Well, wow. it's Saturday. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Good, Good morning. morning. It's Saturday. Saturday. Day number seven. So exciting. Day seven. Thank you so, so much. So we are doing 21 days so of prayer, fasting, and challenges. Yes. And we're so excited you've been joining us. This has been such a fun time. Yeah. If you're new to us, my name's David. This is Carol Joy. We're doing 21 days of prayer, mm -hmm. fasting, and challenges. You can go to the website, believersinternational.church. On there, you can look at what we're looking at right now yeah. under 21 days of prayer and fasting. We have a, or you can print out each day, all 21 days. Each day has a scripture, which we'll do today. Confession today today's challenge and then we're going to pray let's do so it are we ready yeah let's go for start yes, right in. let's do it together so we are in psalm 37 23 it says the steps, steps of, of a good man, man are ordered by, by the lord and he, he delights, delights in, in his way, way. Hallelujah. Awesome. Steps of a good man. You are a good woman. You're a good, good man. man. Yeah. You're a good child. At whatever age you are, you are good. That's if right. you have Jesus Christ living on the inside of you. That's right. Hallelujah. Wow. So the confession. Let's do our confession today. Are yeah. we ready? Here we go. I immediately respond in faith to the guidance of the Holy Spirit within me. I am always in the right place at the right time because my steps are ordered of the Lord. Boy, you know, I say that all the time. I'm always in the right place at the right time speaking to the right people. Hey, your, if your steps are ordered of Him, you can have divine connections. That's right. You can be in the right place at the right time, all the time. Well, you walk in the fog. You say fog yes. of God, the favor of God, the fog, favor of God. Be you in say the fog. That. Yeah, you say that all the time. Yes. Wow. Hallelujah. I like well, what that. is today's challenge Oh today? my gosh, this is Saturday, day seven. Okay. Today's challenge is a beautiful one that everyone's going to love. Oh. It is Cell Phone Saturday. Uh-oh, that doesn't cell sound phone good. Cell Phone Saturday. It's your mobile phone Saturday. Yeah. And Cell Phone Saturday, turn your cell phone off for one hour mm. during the peak of your day today and spend time with God. Ooh, I like that. Turn your cell phone off it's one so, hour. It's so easy to always be on this thing and just looking at it and yeah. la la la. Yeah. Nope. Put it aside <laughs> one hour and <laughs> spend time with the Lord. What I think is interesting about it is because every week, and I'm sure you have phones that do this too, every week it tells you how much you've watched or how much you've been on your phone. Oh. You know, every week. And mm -hmm. it's, you know, I was like, one week it's this many hours, the next week it's that many hours. I'm like, so. I, at first, I'm like, I'm going to try to get it down, but now I don't think about it, and I'm lower than I ever have been before, because I don't. Because before, I think it was just condemning me that I was watching too much <laughs> stuff or something. But I'll yeah. tell you what, everybody, and I, I love it. Everybody in the in the world has these cell phones now. We're able to look up these scriptures, get in the Bible, mm -hmm. talk to FaceTime. each other, communicate. I'm so thankful for FaceTime. Yeah, it's really good. It is. It you know, there's good. There's very many positives about our cell phones, yeah. but then there can be some negatives if you're on there too much or if you're walking out there and not paying attention to who's around you. That's not a good thing. So anyway, it's exciting. We're going to take our cell phone away cell purposely yeah. for Set one hour and just spend time with you. I like it because at the, the peak, it says the peak time of your day. So that could be like, oh, this is the this is the time I usually do this. And this is where we're replacing it with God. Yeah. We're getting in His presence, Hallelujah. spending time with Him. And this whole, I mean, we're on day seven now. This week has been really, really good. It's it getting us in a good. good habit to spend time with Him. Yes, and we're spending time with Him together, yes. which is a journey that will... We'll never forget. No, totally. Yeah. This is fantastic. Yeah. So today's prayer, prayer for Saturday, okay. is this. We're praying for your church or our church. So whatever church you're attending, if you're attending our online church, we're praying for the church. The Yay. church as a whole it's is so the body important. of Jesus Christ. Yeah. No matter what church it is, we want it to thrive and go forward yeah. for God. That's our heart. Yay. And so Colossians 1.10 says this in the Amplified. 
that you, that we may walk and live and conduct ourselves in a manner worthy of the Lord. That's good. Fully pleasing to him and desiring to please him in all things. Mm. Bearing fruit, we're praying for our church and every, bearing fruit in every good work and steadily growing and increasing in the knowledge of God with fuller, deeper, clearer insight. Yeah. Acquaintance and recognition. That is so powerful. Good. Matthew 5, 15 and 16. Let your light so shine before men that they may see your good works and glorify your Father in heaven. Praying for our churches. Mm -hmm. This is the mightiest. The church is the, the most unappreciated community service, but is the mightiest, most powerful, so most directed. It, it's going to last forever. Uh, the fruit that we have as a church and your church, yes. it, eternal fruit is being produced as we send out videos, mm -hmm. as we're ministering to people, as we're giving all these free materials out. We're helping others for an eternal difference in their life. Praise the Lord. And we're doing it all for the kingdom of God to multiply every soul, multiply yeah. so that Jesus can come back. Yeah. You know, when we multiply the church, then he's coming for his glorious bride. Bring it Hallelujah. On. Hallelujah. Yeah. So we're praying today. Yes. Our next paragraph is you're following along. And also on YouTube, you can look in the, the, there's the comment section, but in the directive section right underneath the video there, we have these notes in here every yes. day that we do these. So you're able to go on before you watch the video, if you want to look at all the notes, see what we're doing or read along. So God is so good to us. Yes. And so we're going to pray today for your church. We'll read this first and we're going to pray. Praying that together we would fulfill God's vision. It's God, the church is God's vision. Yeah. And together that we would be the light in the world that would show the love of God in a powerful and tangible way so the, lo the world would take notice and come running to God for salvation. I love that. We're praying that the world would take notice of our Lord Jesus Christ yeah. and come running to God, our Father, Mm, for the salvation of their souls so that yes. we can have eternal life. You know, God created fun. Hello. <laughs> God created fun. So if you're not having fun, then there's something wrong because he <laughs> wants you to have fun. It's true. And we need to show the world that serving God is fun. Yeah. It's not about works. It's not about, yeah. oh, do's and don'ts and don't do, don't you dare do that. Yeah. Oh, la, la. No, yeah. it's about having fun yeah. for the Lord and yeah. living for him. And just, it's freedom. Yeah. And when you know mm. the truth, that's good. the truth will set you free. Yeah. Well, we want others to know the truth. Amen. I think it's really important. You yes. know, the Lord spoke to me years ago mm -hmm. that I wasn't enjoying my life. And when God says, hey, listen, you're not enjoying your life, Whoa. it's kind of like a wake up call. You know, it's like, wait a minute, wait a minute, uh, but I'm doing everything you want me to do, but you're not enjoying the life I'm giving Enjoy the you. journey. Yeah. That's beautiful. We need to enjoy the journey. Yeah. Well, let's pray for our church, let's shall do we? It. Yeah. Father God, I'm using this thank last you, paragraph Father we God. read. Father, we just thank you that together. Yeah. All of us together, we're watching us, family members watching us right now, you're watching us, our friends, together we would fulfill your vision for the church. Yes. Together we would be the light of the world Thank and you. show your love, Father, in a powerful, tangible way. Yes. Use us, Father, Use so us. that the world would take notice yes. and come running to you for salvation. Use us, yes. use us, use everything that we Thank have, you, all of our broadcasts, all of our church services, all Thank of our you, words. God. And for those that are watching, Father yes. God, use them, use them, pick them up and use them. Give them fresh anointing, fresh vision, Touch their hearts, touch their minds, touch their bodies for your glory so that we can take this gospel yes. further and further in Jesus' name. Amen. I just have this in my heart. We speak finances mm. into you, churches, Father, Father God, yes. so that they can go and do yes. what they're called to do. Yes. So we thank you, Father God, that you are supplying Yes. every single need according to your riches and glory by Christ Jesus. And show us, Father God, if there's something that we need yeah. to give 
that yeah, we yeah. will obey and give, Father God, because yes. you said when we give, it shall be given back, pressed down, shaken yes. together, running over. So I thank you that we are all abundantly supplied right. in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name, the church is abundantly supplied. Yes. I love that. Glory to God. Well, listen, happy Saturday happy to you. Happy Saturday. Join us again tomorrow. Go to church. Mm -hmm. um, tomorrow is Sunday. Go to church tomorrow. If you don't have a local church, we have a lot of people that watch us that are persecuted from persecuted nations that don't have a church. Thank you for joining us. We want to put into you encouragement, God's holy yes. word to make you strong and stable and happy yes. and free for the kingdom of God. Glory to God. Thanks for joining us. Pray for your church. Go to church tomorrow. Hallelujah. It's going to be a good day. Yes. Let's end this time together for the kingdom, but you're going forward. And everything you're going to do today is for the kingdom. On the count of three, let's say for the kingdom. One, two, three, for, for the, the kingdom. kingdom. Make it a great day. We will see you tomorrow morning for the broadcast. And we're happy you're joining us in Jesus' name.